Uh, hey guys, I just want to make a video because I I know I had spoken about the testosterone that comes in like the epi epipen style. And I know that I wanted to last time make a video of myself injecting it. Um, <laughs> I, thought, I thought I was recording the video, but I wasn't. So I'm going to go ahead and do that this week. And then also I wanted to talk about the fact that that same company that makes that. So Xyostead, X-Y-O-S-T-E-D. Um, so they, if you go on their website, you can actually order like one of the, um, the how are they called? Uh, shark disposal containers um, for free. They just hand, like send them out to anybody. You don't even have to be ordering like one of their, like their EpiPen testosterone. So they'll just send it to you. You just put in your address and they're like, oh yeah, we'll send that to you. So you open it up and inside is the actual container. Let me open it up. And this is in there. Let me just take off the lid. There they go in there. Um, and then when you're done, it gives you like a bag, a sharp's bag, that you put this inside of, and then you put it in here, and then it already has the return postage on the top, so you don't have to pay to send it back, like the collection part. So, it's a pretty good deal. Free, you can't beat that. So, yep, so I'm just going to store the return away. Okay, just a sec. So yep, yeah, this is a gallon. One gallon. Yep. All right. So, for those of you who missed this last time, this pen comes in a 75 milligram, um, sorry, 50 milligram, 75 milligram, and then also 100 milligram. This is a 75 milligram. Normally I would take 100, um, but I got these as a sample from a doctor's office. So I'm trying the 75 milligram. Also, they said that um, the the uh, testosterone ethanate um, absorbs into your body better. So um, a lot of the time, people who switch from like cyanate um, can lower their dose. So 75 milligram might work for me. Um, even though I'm used to taking 100 milligrams of the type of Mind you, not a medical professional. None of the information that I'm sharing here is medical advice whatsoever. You always need to talk to your doctor. Um, I'm just sharing what I've learned as a patient. So, yep. So, I'm going to go ahead and do this. And um, also, this... Um, um, I don't know. The dosage inside of this is just one single dose and it's 0.5 milliliters. So, yep. So, when you open it up, it's just the EpiPen itself and then some instructions. Oops. All right. And so, last time when I was talking about it, this was already orange because um, I had already used it. So if you watched the last video, you heard me say, oh, well, it was clear before I used it. And so you can see that it's clear. That's the actual testosterone in there. Okay. Um, and so I'm going to have to, let's see. I'm gonna try and do it a little higher than you would think. So I want you guys to be able to see it. Okay, let me do it. Like in this area. Okay. Alright, so you just need to break the seal. So you do this, open it up. The needle, I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, you can see it a little. It's right inside of there. And this piece, 
gets pushed down against you, and then the needle goes inside. All right. I'm gonna try to do it in a way that you guys can. So you see the orange, you see the orange piece here will progressively go up as the testosterone goes inside. So you push it, hold for 10 seconds, and then release. Now I will say the white piece, the spring inside is difficult to push. So let's see. See that orange? And then I'll show you guys, there's like probably no blood at all. So yep, um, now you see that the orange piece has exposed itself, the testosterone is gone, the needle is still inside, um, and I didn't feel anything. The pinching of the skin is the worst part. So now I just take this, and then the whole thing will go inside. And then I'll show you guys the fact that I don't think it bled at all. Let's see. Yeah, so it was like in this spot, you can see where I pinched it, but there's really no blood literally at all. So yeah. Alright guys, see ya.